Oh my gosh, what is happening? Oh no! Oh no, we're getting abducted by aliens! Hey everybody, I'm Kelsey. I love colorful things. And today we're going to be doing the not so very challenge. It's a challenge in The Sims 4 where you have 10 generations and each generation is themed after a color and has specific requirements that you need to complete in order to complete the generation. Right now we are on generation mint. It's the first generation. And if you're interested in what all of the requirements are, there's gonna be a link below. Last time on the series, we were kind of still debating between the two mans. I didn't want to move forward with either of them until I heard some news from you guys. It seemed like y'all were 50-50. It feels like a lot of you were team Tobias and that a lot of you were also team Raphael, but I'm not gonna lie. You know me, I'm a drama queen. I love the drama. So I think I'm going to go team Raphael for this one. And if he gives me any big red flags, then we'll turn tail, we'll find Blaze, we'll find find, you know, Tobias and we'll make it work. In the challenge, the Rose generation, which is the next generation, has their child and that child is supposed to be close friends with Minth, the first generation. Kind of confusing, but essentially Minth needs to be alive for her grandchild. So I really obviously want to make that happen without having to cheat. So we're going to hopefully move right along into child rearing, which I don't know, I'm enjoying not having children in the game, but we got to do what we got to do. If you aren't already, make sure to hit that subscribe subscribe button and turn on that notification bell so you are notified every time a new episode of the series goes live. I do weekly uploads on Wednesdays and Saturdays, so make sure not to miss out. So we're gonna go to manage worlds, actually. I also noticed that some of you commented that you wanted Chelsea and Simeon to break up and for her to get together with Craig so we could see all that happen. I totally agree. I, I don't like that she's with the Simeon character, so we're gonna break them up. Pretend it never happened. Simeon has moved in with her, apparently and all of her children, which is like, fine. Here's Simeon. I feel like I'm gonna divorce. Yeah, and then clear all relationships. Forget everyone active. Yeah, he doesn't have any relationship with any other sis. And then I'm going to just like yeet him out. So obviously you gotta go, dude. Just don't want you in there. Yes, I gotta rename this. It's the impeachment. May. Literally, how dare he go in, change all their last names. I just cannot. I'm going to move Brielle in with her sibling. And then I'm gonna move Craig in with his wife. And then we're gonna add him as her husband. And now you can see that it is out with Simeon and in with Craig. Craig and Chelsea are together. The end. Craig is now married to Chelsea. We don't need to worry about Simeon being in the picture anymore. They're divorced. We can move on with our story. So we're back in Mint's little summer home. It is Sunday morning, which is a a perfect day, I think, to maybe go on a date. So let's ask out on a date, Raphael, and see what he says. It seemed like he was down, but it seems like my date thing is still like glitch. So we'll just like go to hang out together. So we're gonna travel with him and then we'll ask him on a date when we're out with him. Hopefully that'll work. Or they'll just not go on an official date. I don't know why my game's a little glitched, but unfortunately it seems like maybe some of my mods glitched the game. All right, so where should they go on their first date? Mint and him, they're kind of smarties. So I feel like a coffee shop or maybe like a museum or a bar could be good. Or they could go to the on hot estate. I think that's a cute first date. They're gonna walk around the grounds, learn a little bit of history. There's plenty of uh, places to canoodle, gorgeous views, and they can just get to know each other outside of work. Oh, attractiveness alert. Oh my gosh. Of course, immediately Mint is like, he's so attractive. I need to pick my job off the floor and talk to him. It looks like they're both bored, which is absolutely Absolutely hilarious. And then, oh my gosh, is that our, that's uh, Wolfgang Munch, who is our kind of like, not rival, but like that weird teen that kind of got mad at us that one time. Good times. Why don't you flatter him? Okay, there's a lot of people showing up in full suits of armor. I guess an event's coming on today. 
tell a joke about Mimes. I know he likes her goofy side and then we'll do a little flirt, see how it goes. They're both bored. I love that they're on the same page. They need to do something fun. They need to spice it up. Oh, wow, there's a ghost over here. They're just ignoring it though. They're just talking to each other. Okay, it's a pleasant conversation and she's about to figure out about the ghost. We got to flirt, compliment his appearance. He's like talking about how bored he is. It's a casual discussion. What do they want to do? Watch a movie, enthuse about vegetarianism, or be mischievous. You can be mischievous. Oh, become partners in crime? Wait, that's so cute. Oh my God, they both did such awkward reactions. They're now partners in crime though. Wait, she was like, I just heard you became friends with Tobias Ryder. He's pretty cool. Hazel's like, are you talking to both of them? What's going on? I feel like they need to do something goofy. You know, you know what's fun? I got you guys. Listen, I know it's fun. Slip, oh, slide. We need our outdoor slide. Yes, it's slip and slide day. I don't make the rules. Okay, there just happens to be a great slip and slide. Add soap and then slide with Raphael. All right, they're gonna go slip and slide. Raphael's like, where is this girl going? And Mint is like, just you wait and see, okay? It's just gonna add some bubbles and then they're gonna go slide in. Yeah, try be bored now on this date. Let's go. Oh, he just smacked. Here she goes, it's her turn now. Do a little trick slide, queen. Oh yeah, feisty, we love it, rare. Okay, girl. Are you having fun yet? Hopefully the boredom is going away. Yeah, it's going away. <laughs> She's doing it. Oh yeah, she's happy now. Enthused about interests. Okay, yeah, she's now energized, which I love. We just needed to do something fun. Plan to wrap bacon around everything. He found her so funny. Wait, this is Blaze. Why don't you have like a little funny, friendly introduction with Blaze? I mean, why not? He's a cutie still. I wanna know if she finds him attractive. Inside joke. Just make him laugh a lot. I feel like that'll be make funny faces. Oh, they're both laughing at her jokes. Oh, this is great. Oh, she's startled by a ghost. Where's the ghost? Suspicious. She needs to go to the restroom. Go take a little panicked, panicked poop because she's scared from the ghost. Okay, she's now playful, which is great. Go introduce yourself. I want to see what you think of him. I want to see if you're attracted to him or not. Very attractive, but he's not extremely attractive like our boy Raphael is. Raphael just popped off for a sec. Okay, there he is. Go make a flirtatious joke with him. You're feeling very flirty from having some attractive memories. Oh, flirt it up, girl. I want them to become like a group. So let's add him to group. Perfect. <gasps> first kiss? Bright as day. They can have their first kiss. Oh my gosh, how cute is this? The sun is setting. We need to have a perfect area. Oh my gosh, is this perfect or what? Go here together. Look how gorgeous this spot is. I know you're hungry, but wait for him to get here, okay? Okay, they're here together. Compliment his appearance. And then first kiss. Ooh, okay, here we go, here we go. No, don't leave, it's right there is perfect. Okay, yes, 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 yes. She's like, you are looking great today. Do you work out? And then oh, here he comes, here he comes. Wait, I don't wanna miss it, I don't wanna miss it. Yes, their first kiss. She's vibing it. They are definitely becoming very flirty. She's feeling silly. She's gonna flash some crazy eyes, make some flirtatious jokes with him. I think what she's putting on the moves, he's definitely interested. And he thinks she's funny. He loved that joke that she just did. Hold hands, they can hold hands. That's so cute. He's got little zits. They jumped up fast from that kiss, I think. Oh, she could ask to be his boyfriend. I think that's a little soon. They're having so much fun flirting with each other. Ask about his attraction preferences. He did say he liked piercings last time, so maybe if he says it again, she'll go get a piercing and be like, I got a piercing, isn't that cool? I've been thinking about it for a while anyway. I like body piercing, he said it again. Oh my gosh. Blow him a kiss. He got on his phone. Get off your phone, Sims. Don't confess your attraction. Don't do it, don't do it. Oh my God, she did it and he was okay with it. Hold hands, blow a kiss. Oh my gosh, this is going very well. How cute are they? Wait, she could do a passionate kiss now? Oh my gosh. <laughs> I loved it. She's really liking him. I think he likes her too, but I don't want to rush things. 
Complain about first kiss? Don't you dare. Not the best kiss. Oh no. And she's cold. Maybe it was because she was cold that it wasn't the best kiss. Oh, but she just kissed him again. She likes him. Maybe it was because they're both so cold. Oh my gosh, they're both freezing. I wanted to be like, let's bring him home, but let's not. Let's be going home. Bye, Raphael. We're going to maybe get a piercing. I think she'd look cute with a little piercing. Just a little nose ring or something cute. We're gonna go plan an outfit in the mirror and she's gonna get a little piercing because I think that went really well. And then she might get a little kitty. Here she is. I feel like a nose or the brow is cute. I mean, the brow kind of matches the rest of it. I feel like a nose ring could be cute for her or she could get both. She could go really ham. And she's like, I like him so much. He said he likes piercings. I've been thinking about it anyway. She wasn't, but now she kind of is. Yeah, she did a brow and a nose piercing. She went all in. She's very hungry. So let's get some leftovers of a salad. Luckily, I made something that was vegetarian because the number of times that I've messed that up is astronomical. Oh, we need more money to adopt. So we actually need to go into work tomorrow before we can adopt anyway. We have work on 11 hours. So I guess she should go to bed, but she's feeling very passionate. Maybe she should give him like a cute little text. While she's thinking about him, she's like, hey, Raphael. It was so cool hanging out. Oh, but she needs to talk to Lyra. Maybe she'll do that tomorrow night. She's gonna, oh, go use a pad and tampon. Oh no, she's dripping blood. Apparently she's on her period. So she needed to clean that all up. Ooh, she's got some acne going on. Maybe we should do a little treatments. Yeah, let's do weekly treatments. I think she's got a little face mask on now. She's doing some breakthroughs. She just leveled up. Logic level seven is here. All right, she's gonna put on her face mask and then maybe go to sleep. Yes, put on that face mask, queen. And she's gonna sleep it off. <gasps> the cafe is doing a cat cafe theme today. Do you wanna go and get some coffee and pet some cats? Yes! Uh, oh my God! I'm so annoyed that my game is doing this. I need to fix this. I don't know what this bug is, but she is going to work in like an hour. So she's gonna try to focus on work. I mean, I'm sure Raphael will be there. She needs to upgrade the sim ray. Where's her sim ray? Boom. We need to get transform object who's here but Raphael we're currently on level five of the scientist skill so we're hopefully gonna get up to level six today her skin's looking great after that little treatment I love that for her okay oh we need to drink or give away a tainted serum I think we do have a tainted serum so let's give it away to Liza pancakes we're always so mean to her. Give tainted serum. That's our mint. Oh, she's given a update, but it looks like that it's a little broken. She needs to probably fix it, but it's not on our list yet to do. Hey, would you like some tainted snake oil? I mean, um, snake oil. Oh my gosh, it made Eliza pass out. There he is, our possible bae who we've kissed now. Give us some synthetic food. We don't have synthetic food, but I guess we can make it. Oh my gosh, they're all chatting. They're talking about Hazel. Maybe they just caught up about what Hazel's weekend was. Success, she created a serum. Okay, so why don't you give it to Paka? Uh, oh, he doesn't want it. Why don't you give it to Raphael? I feel like Raphael will take it. Raphael, will you take... <gasps> Do you want to go on a date today? Oh, no thanks, I'm busy right now. Oh! I can't go to Tobias just asked her on a date. That's too little too late, Tobias. I can't believe Tobias just tried to ask her on a date. He must have just saw, like, found out that she's been chatting with uh, someone else and was like, okay, I'm interested. I'm like, nope, it's too late. Where would we converse about aliens? Oh, okay, just anything about aliens under friendly. She's gonna be like, I feel like there are aliens. Something smells, but it's not mint because her hygiene's spectacular. Eliza's like, I've never thought about that. Flirt with someone after drinking a rose perfume serum. Oh my gosh. I don't think we have a rose perfume serum, which means that we gotta like purchase some seeds and then like hopefully open the packet and have roses. Let's see, we've got holly. That's it. Starter flowers. How are we supposed to get roses? I, I'm using up all my money on seed packets. 
None of them were roses. We have enough to buy like a little bit more rose perfume, but it would just be so fun to have the rose perfume serum. Let's look around. Maybe there's a rose bush around the premises. So, so far, I don't think there's a rose bush at all. We're gonna buy more flowers and hope for the best. I'm using up all my money. Got Snapdragon. We got like 21 daisies, 18 bluebells, basil, and no roses. I'm gonna sell the daisies and hopefully try again. No roses, no roses. I can't do any of these things. This is so annoying. I guess we'll purchase another seed packet of starter vegetables and hope for the best. We got carrot and we got bell pepper. Is that what we need for the serum? We need parsley. I don't think we have enough money for parsley unless we sell something. I hope I don't need more snapdragons. Now we need starter herbs. Hopefully we'll get parsley in it. Parsley, yes! We're gonna be able to make this slimify. What the heck? What are you doing? Okay, great. It's tainted. Oh no. Okay, well, we'll we'll definitely give it away. Give it away to Eliza again. What a sweetheart. Eliza always takes the stuff. Invent the satellite dish. Okay. Oh my gosh, we did it. Contact aliens. Let's go. Workday's gonna end in one hour. Start neighborhood hive mind. We're gonna make it a happy town. I like making everyone happy. That makes me happy. And then analyze the DNA sample. Okay, for sure. What? Why is, are they all walking like that? It's so funny. Our mad scientist, Minth, just experimented with her coworkers. Minth did a fantastic job today. She made 800 civilians, but she is not a next level. I think tomorrow we'll get the promotion though. We gotta pay our bills which is gonna take up almost all of our money. No, we can maybe call over Lyra and see if we can become friends. Invite to hang over at current lot, Lyra. I wanna become friends. Lyra's here. So they're coming in. Discuss interests. Oh my gosh, is she gonna pass out? No, man. I, okay, that's on me. I, oh, she's angry. Why is Lyra so angry? Okay, man, I want you to have your heart to heart with Lyra. Maybe ask if she's okay. Oh my gosh, she's just going to bed. She's like, I'm too tired. No, she had a little sleep. She's like, I'm so tired, Kelsey, let me do this. I'm like, no, I want, Lyra's over. You need to talk to her. Oh, she's very mad. Share her, share your insecurities. <gasps> oh, it did not help Lyra at all. It's an unpleasant conversation. Apologize to her. Was your day okay? Is what, what's going on? Oh no, she's just storming out. Well, that was awkward. Can she ask about Raphael? Be like, what's going on with you and Raphael? I wanna check in. You might've had a rough day. Does it have to do with me? She likes him. I like Raphael, he's pretty cool. She just said pretty cool. Oh my gosh, did she just blame that on us? That's so funny. Apologize again, brighten her day. Let's try to like calm her down. She won't accept our apology. I think she's just in a bad mood. Everything we do, Lyra is getting mad at us about. A part of me wonders, oh my gosh, what is happening? Oh no! Oh no, we're getting abducted by aliens! We just wanted to take a nap. Lyra's like, all right, I'm glowing with anger. We just got abducted. We just needed to pee and talk it out. Oh, this is what happens when you contact aliens. I hope she doesn't come back pregnant. Oh no, she's getting cramps because of her period. My favorite series is about to come on, so I should get home. Thanks for spending time with me. See you later. Okay, that was weird. Oh, here she comes. Oh, it was awesome. She loved it. She was like, this was amazing. She loved being abducted by aliens. This is so cute. Seeing all that amazing alien technology truly boggles the mind, even when it's being used on you. I think that maybe Lyra just had a bad day and, you know, Minth kind of bringing up those things didn't help is my guess. I don't think that it was maybe personal, but I don't know. Can you make a sack lunch with a veggie and hummus sandwich? Because it only ever gives you enough time to make it. Hey babe, are you busy? I miss you and I want to see you. Can you come over right now? Oh, that's so cute. But <laughs> well, we're going to work in like a couple minutes, you goon. I'm gonna click okay, even though we never get to go. <laughs> Please finish making your food, girl. You gotta hurry up. First things first, we gotta buy ourselves a snack. A faux BLT sounds perfect because that, of course, is veggie safe. Oh my gosh. No! No! No, Minth! <laughs> she 
just held her stomach. We gotta upgrade the sim ray. Just because the first baby's an alien doesn't mean it necessarily has to be the next gen. Okay, we upgraded that. Ask a coworker for a medal. Obviously, we're gonna ask our girl. Okay, good. good. Mind control to clean. She's gonna mind control Liza Pancakes. She's like, Liza, clean it up. <laughs> She's got like this evil laugh. Look at her. <laughs> Ball. Let's order Renee to garden. And then we can happen to be in the same room as Bay and kind of converse with him about aliens. She has to tell him about all that went down last night that she got abducted by aliens. Okay. No. She's doing that thing with her stomach again. I'm very nervous. Theorize about aliens. Oh, why is he in a bad relationship with Paka Uha? Oh, she should fix it. Oh, she should mind control him to change outfits. That'd be so funny. Oh my gosh, Tobias. Hey, beautiful. Do you want to go on a date? I can't wait for you to get ready. I'm busy now, Tobias. Also, I'm kind of talking to Raphael, but I'm also going to mind control him right now because I'm kind of rude. Is he going to do it? Oh my gosh, she's so cute! This little athletic gear. She's like cracking herself up. Let's have a deep conversation with Paka. And then we need to mind control as well to change outfit. And we'll do party wear. I want to see what Paka's party wear is. Change outfit, sleepwear. Give away or drink a tainted serum. Do we have a tainted serum to give away? Oh, we do. We wouldn't do Paka like that. We would do Eliza like that because we always do Eliza like that. Oh, he looks great. And we're going to do this again to Eliza. Perfect. Eliza changed into her pajamas. If I had known her pajamas were kind of shorts in a tank, I might have not done that. I don't want to make her uncomfortable in the workplace, but hopefully Eliza's chill with it. Okay, we'll analyze a metal and then we'll ask for a crystal. <gasps> uncomfortable. She felt a little baby kick. Oh, no, this is not what I planned. I just don't understand. Gosh, you have to tell him. You know what? Maybe we should invite him after work. I feel a little comfortable, uncomfortable talking about this at work. She found a new medal. Good for you, girl. Also, apparently there's like this. Yeah, household collections. We have 14 of 20 medals and crystals. We have 15 of 10. Oh, here's elements. 13 of 15. So technically we actually are missing one, two, three of them because there's an extra get to work one. But apparently it's pretty uncommon. Put a plant sample under the microscope. Analyze the sample. She doesn't have like a plant sample, I don't think. Or under the microscope. Oh, under this. Analyze plant sample. Oh, she's got one. Come on, queen. You gotta, you gotta hustle. Hustle hard. Mind control of Sims to clean. I mean, we already did that, but let's do it again. Poor Eliza is like, I've had a rough day. Oh my gosh. Share insecurities. Oh, prevent abductions. Wait, we could have done that? We could have prevented abductions and they didn't tell me to do that yesterday? Mint did a fantastic job and she got it promoted. I am still very upset, but we have enough money to buy a pet. Raphael! Raphael wants us to come over, but why don't we ask him to hang out here? We need to have a talk with him about what's going on. The drama is so real. Oh my gosh, Raphael, I think we might be pregnant. Invite him in. I mean, there's no other moodlets though. Well, I don't want her to be pregnant. I don't want her to be pregnant. Cheat and have it not happen. It didn't happen. It never happened. Give him some residence keys. Oh no, she's soups pregnant. It's really happening. Oh my gosh, she's got to tell him. He's feeling flirty. Oh, she asked, invited him to spend the night and he said yes. She's also giving him keys to the house. Brighten his day. They're making some bold moves in the relationship right now. But I feel like we have to talk about our stomach thing. Like, why is that not an option? Why can't we talk to him about possibly having a baby right now? Oh, he's just going to bed. He's like, I'm kind of tired. Honestly, I just want to get the mischief done. Actually, I think we can just troll the four rooms and that counts as mischief. Let me see. Yep, it does. Take a nice little bath. And then I want you to troll the forums. She's got all of her needs are pretty high. She just probably needs to go to sleep. Oh, they're so cute. They spent the night. I bet she's feeling kind of scared because last night, you know, they abducted her. So I feel like that's why she invited him over was to be like, hey, can you spend the night? I'm a little scared. <gasps> she is got a weird tummy ache and she looks pregnant. No. 
ask him if he wants kids. I'm open to the idea of having kids. Oh, good. Wait, should we ask him to be our boyfriend? I mean, we gave him a key to our house. I don't think this is too fast. Be like, will you be my boyfriend? I don't know when she can tell him, but she's gonna tell him as soon as she knows for sure about the pregnancy. So I don't think she's hiding it from him or anything like that. I think that she just like herself can't really figure this, whatever is happening to her out. How cute is this? This feels like a good normal day in Mint's life. I mean, not super normal, but like a little normal day. I want her to give him a nice little cheek caress. He's so happy. They're like very close. Oh, they just got a really cute sentiment that's deeply connected. Mint has a powerful bond with Raphael that is a source of strength and comfort. He is all in with her. And she tried to kind of talk with our girl Lyra, but Lyra was not interested. Oh, she wants to woohoo with someone. I mean, the poor girl has already been pre like is already pregnant. Hasn't even gotten to woohoo yet with her love. She like loves Raphael. Raphael hasn't been to Woohoo Town yet. Very sad. I mean, she's feeling passionate. They could have a woohoo, but then it would be confusing, I think, for Raphael because he might think it's the baby's his and it's not. I have a thing, so I will see you another time. So he needed to go anyway. I think that's for the best. I don't think that they should woohoo without her first being able to tell about the situation of what happened. And she still apparently cannot, even though like she's obvi pregnant. Okay, why don't you please troll the forums? There you go. And then maybe send some chain letters. Bob Pancakes already hates us for real. So we're gonna just continue making all of those people mad. We're just gonna go to work pregnant. Everyone's gonna notice. Unexpected visitors alert. Aliens have infiltrated headquarters and are trying to pass themselves as humans. Very suspicious. Be on the lookout for them and any sabotage equipment. No! They are ruining Mint's life. Who's this? Levi Cotter. Yeah, he's definitely sus. Glenn Castle. Introduce ourselves. Which one of you is the one that got our Mint pregnant? That's what I want to know. Lie about your career to a tourist? She's feeling so passionate. Oh, it's from feeling that close connection with her babe. Oh, look at her. Oh my gosh, wait, she's having weird tummy stuff again. All right, we need to find a tourist. Could they be a tourist? Sure, we'll pretend he's a tourist. She's gonna chat with him. Lie about career, and then we need to tell him a funny story. Why didn't we do that the first time? Okay, what about this girl? Yeah. We're working on a relationship, so thanks for helping us through it. Oh, cute, he and Paka are chatting. That's so sweet. I'm so happy that him and Paka are having a deep combo. Oh, use the Sims or a tourist. They didn't like it, but it's fine. Okay, write up research on the computer. We might stay late just because I really want her to do well today at work. Complain about pregnancy pains. There it is. All right, she's gonna tell him. He's like, oh my gosh, really? He got adoring sentiment. Mint just wants her the best for Raphael and thinks he's so wonderful. Look, he has a deeply connected uh, sentiment for her, but she also like adores him. And they're soulmates. This is too cute. And she just complained to him about like the baby stuff and he did not seem all that incensed about it. So I think that's like a really good sign. Ooh, we made some mad money today though. We are starting to make some really good money <laughs> in this career, which is good because we have a baby on the way and I'm gonna need to add to the house. We're gonna adopt a cat for Minth. I think she would definitely be a cat fan. Something else is happening here, but we're gonna just focus on the cat thing. Which cat would be for Minth? I feel like I like... Lily, she's spayed and a kitten. Okay, let's go with Lily for the cat. I'm assuming this man is here. He's the adopted agent. Oh my gosh, the cat's here. Lily is so cute. Okay, let's do a cautious introduction to Lily. I hope Lily has a good personality. Lily, cute. Okay, Mint just became acquaintances with Lily. Can we pet Lily and maybe give like a big treat? Lily likes us. Yes, we will be taking care of Lily. Okay, Lily. Should I think of another like mint green name? I think like Fern is okay. I don't know. I'll just name it Kitty and I'll have you guys um, give me some names in the comments. It'll be named Kitty Berry. 
And then I think we're gonna do a little adjustment of the cat, maybe give it some more mint vibes. So we need pet stuff. That's perfect for Lily in the corner over here. Lily's bowl could be like here. I actually was thinking we might make the island bigger. Great, and we'll put a little bar stool there too. Oh yeah, there was something in our inventory. I think we've gained a couple things. Oh, a little table lamp. Could get a second side table. So I'm going to put like this. But now she's got two side tables, which is good. And then we got, oh, a chemistry lab. Oh, cause she can have a full on chemistry lab in her room. <laughs> That's kind of cool. We'll have the chemistry lab. Maybe we'll have this under this window here and the chemistry lab here. Although the that's kind of like interrupting the bed. Maybe we'll pull it out like a boop, just a little bit. Oh my goodness, what is this? Okay, there's just a test pedestal thing now in her room. <laughs> her room is getting very odd. <laughs> and let's get a desk. I think she's more academic, so maybe she would want something with books. We definitely want like a minty chair. Yeah, that one's good. And we can move the computer now into here. And then I think in her own inventory, there was like a couple things. Yeah, there's like this Rhapsody in blue photo with that in the bedroom. I don't like how high it is there, but then I don't like how low it is either. Maybe we'll put the plant on the other side of the room. There you go. That's more balanced, I think. We'll have like a little cat toy over here to play with the cat. Oh, here we go, a little scratch post. Cute. And that'll be here for the cat as well. She's grabbed everything from the mailbox. Let's see if there's any new. Yes! Okay, we've got one. All right, so we only got two left. Let's see on our elements. We've got 14 of 15. <gasps> oh, but this one's still missing technically, but it still says 14 of 15. We'll try to get them all, but if we only get like all but one, I think it's not the end of the world since that one was technically not included in this pack. It was added in a later pack. I don't know. I want to modify the household in Kaz. I want to adjust the kitty and add some cute little like minty vibes to kitty. I'm going to change the eye color of the cat, the minty green. That's cute. Actually, you know what? I kind of like it white because then we can kind of maybe make the paws like a minty green and it won't be the end of the world if the paws are green. Does that make sense? Like minty green socks. Is that weird? Or you know what? Maybe we'll just do a mint green tail. I think that's cute. <laughs> so I think we'll leave that like that with the little green tail. Kitty berry. Oh, kitty matches the decor so well. Look how cute kitty is. So tiny and small. Weird weight gain. Mint has to put on a few pounds. Surely this is just a phase. Oh no, she's so pregnant. I cannot right now with how pregnant she is. Oh no, Kitty's being mischievous. Play with the laser pointer with Kitty. Oh wait, Kitty needs a litter box. I honestly want the expensive one so that I don't need to do it myself. Oh, we match. This is so cute. We'll take our thoughtful shower. Hopefully get our final breakthrough that we need for our promotion to be scientist level seven. Oh, we did not have the thoughtfulness. Read something really fast. Oh, she did. Okay, Mint has had her 12th breakthrough and wrote down an idea for a ghost goo serum. So we now have Kitty Berry. You guys need to let me know in the comments who to name Kitty Berry. Mint now has a boyfriend. She's also pregnant from an alien. So I need your guys' opinion on whether or not the alien baby should be the next gen baby or should that maybe be the firstborn and then we actually have the baby. I'm leaning towards, I really want to actually have her own baby with Raphael be uh, the baby moving forward. I don't know if I want alien DNA up in my challenge like immediately. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching this video. I'll see you around the internet very soon. Bye.